what's going on guys welcome back to the channel today i want to share with you another intro animation for hitfilm express so just download it and open it up inside hitfilm then after you open it up you will have to probably relink this file audio.mp3 uh, just relink it it's pretty simple then all you have to do is just open up the images that you want to use for the logo i'm going to use this apple logo and for the background i'm going to use this image uh, you can obviously use a video if you want to so just double click on the bg composite double click on that and just drag and drop your image or a video whatever you want to use and uh, if it's too big just scale it down and just position it properly i like how it is so i'm just going to leave it as it is close out of this and then you just have to go inside your if you want to use a logo you just go to place your logo comp just drag and drop your icon or the logo and if it's too big just scale that down and make sure it fits within this composition size then close out of this by default if you select the bg2 composite uh, by default you can see the source layer is set to your name so this it will be a text animation instead of a logo animation so let's check that out right so you can see the text appears and if you want to change the text you just select the layer that says your name and change it to whatever you want and type in motion epic and the font that i'm using is pbas new with the font size 228 and set to bold uh, and you can just like play around with different settings you can increase the character spacing and all that stuff and similarly with the tagline as well you can just type in anything that you want and now if you want to use a logo all you have to do is select the bg2 composite and from the source layer you have to select place your logo layer right and here we go that's pretty much it that's how we can edit this template all you have to do is just export this animation so i'm going to click on this arrow thingy and from this list i'm going to select export now contents right or if you want to rename the file you can just select export now or maybe add to queue yeah but that's just about it guys i hope you liked this little animation if you did then make sure you like the video and also subscribe to the channel thanks so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one